hello, single cancer, single cancer. Hey, this reading is going to be for February the 9th, 2024, single cancer. All right, the first number is a five. The second number for my single cancer is a three. Five, three. Hmm. <laughs> Five cancers is about a crisis, a crisis conflict, and three is about connecting and creating. So some of you guys might be connecting with someone that you have you've been having some kind of conflict with. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. All right. Single cancer. All right. What do we have for my single cancer spirit? What do we have for my single cancer at this time? Single cancer. What do we have for single cancer at this time? Spirit of the earth, water, fire, and air. Show me the cards I really need to see and speak for my single cancers. What do my single cancers need to know at this time? Truth and clarity. Single cancers. We have ooh, moving. Some of you guys could be moving. A change of resident. Moving in with your partner. Hmm. All right. What else for my single cancer? We have open up your heart. It would help you attract more love. Open up your heart. It would help you attract more love. All right, what else for my single cancer? Show me cards I really need to see and speak. My single cancer. Date night. Get ready to be wine and dine. Okay, got date night coming up, cancers. Hmm, single cancers. What else for my single cancers? Hmm, we have guardian. A lost loved one watches over you. Mm. What else for my single cancer? Challenges. You have challenges. Make decisions. Work on your inner healing. Hmm. In the bottom of the deck, vacation. Some of you guys could be getting some a, a divorce or a breakup. It could be happening. Some of you guys could be experiencing of a divorce or somebody that's in your energy could be experiencing a divorce or a breakup. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Challenges. So I'm gonna call I really need to see and speak for cancers, single cancers. Challenges. So I'm gonna call I really need to see and speak. What are the challenges for my single cancers? Make a decision, work on your entry healing. What are the challenges right now for my single cancers? What are the challenges right now for my single cancers? Hmm. Turning your back on someone. Or someone that turned their back on you. And yeah, you need to heal. Your challenges right now is someone that turned your back on, someone that turned their back on, on you. That you need to heal from this person. This person could be married, or you could be you could have been married to this person or have kids with this person. Or this person could be still dealing with the baby mama and baby daddy. Let's work on you make a decision about this. Work on your inner healing. Some of you guys need to turn your back on someone so you can heal. This you could be your family or siblings or someone you to be married to. Or you need to turn your back on and heal for someone that could be married to someone else or have kids with someone else. That's your challenges right now. Hmm. All right, moving, moving, change your resident, moving in with your partner. Hmm, tell me more about this moving for single cancers. Show me the cards I really need to see and speak. But truth and clarity, moving, change your resident. Tell me more about this moving for my single cancer. Moving. Ooh, some of you guys could be moving with someone that you have a lot of love for. This is something that could have been planned. Hmm. But it all came crumbling down. That was a tower here. Because you find out some kind of truth about someone that could be married or still dealing with their baby mama, baby daddy. This is the one that you wanted to commit to this person, but you want to have a truthful uh, conversation with this person. But you know, your person might be indecisive about having this conversation with you. And you're trying to protect yourself from this person. Or you need to protect yourself because this person could have been dealing with a queen of style, a queen of ones. They, yeah, they go, they, that this person goes down. You need to protect yourself. 
from a queen of wands. This is one that could have left your person or your person left this person. Mm. And all you wanted to have like a, 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 a honest conversation with this person. This is someone that you're supposed to have moved in with this person. But something happened. Mm. And you find out some kind of truth. And you want this person to talk to you about uh, uh, telling you the truth about something. Mm. Okay, vacation. Show me cards I really need to see and speak. Vacation. You'll be traveling soon. Why this card is here for my single cancer. Vacation. Show me cards I really need to see. Vacation for single cancer. Ooh. Some of you guys could be traveling soon because you're very emotional right now. But someone could have betrayed you, stabbing your back. So that your luck could, would change. This person mad and angry could be jealous of you. This is something. Some, some of you guys want to leave right now. So that you can have drinks or have some kind of celebration. Because you feel like someone could be lying on you. You feel, like this, you feel like this person wants things to be cut out of your life. Could be your family. Or because of someone. That wants to be in the family with you. Or this could be your, your own family. This is someone that won an opportunity with you. Could be your Aries, baby daddy. Or someone that has their own business. Some of you guys will be traveling soon. Yeah, you could. Hmm, very no, you're very emotional right now. You feel betrayed. You feel like somebody wants your luck to change. Because this person mad and mad and angry and jealous of you. This person could be living a distance and acting distant toward you. Because they could have had a reunion with someone that could have told them a lie. Or this one that wants a reunion with you, but that person could have told a lie. Told you a lie. This is one that could have turned their back on you. This is someone that could be in your family because of their family. This is one that wanted the opportunity with you. Or you wanted an opportunity with this person. Could be an Aries. Baby daddy. Someone that live in their ego. Or this is someone who have their own uh their own business. Yeah, some of you guys want to take a vacation. Hmm. Open your heart. Why this card is here for my single cancer. Open your heart. It would help you attract more love. Tell me more about this opening your heart for my single cancer. Open your heart, single cancer. Open your heart. Ooh, open your heart. Because a lot of people find you very attractive, cancers. A lot of people like the way you look, how you dress, or how you wear red. <laughs> the people like the way that you like to take care of uh, animals. You like animals around you. And then you would take action. Hmm. So people see you as a go-getter. Extremely attractive. People see you as some kind of uh, kind, a leader, independent. Hmm. Open your heart because a lot of people see you very attractive. You got a lot of people feeling guilty about what they have done to you. These are people that want to work on things with you. But these are people that try to manipulate you. Now they're sad because you're walking away from them. You're putting all that love into, that loving into you. These are people that have a lot, putting have a lot of burns on their back right now because they cause this tower in your life. You could have been married to this person or have kids with this person or a person could have been married to someone else. Yeah, you could have found out some kind of truth. Oh, you about to find some kind of truth. This is someone that was committed to someone that could have left them out in the cold. Hmm. Open your heart. You find out some kind of truth about someone that you was committed to. Left you out in the cold? Could have left you out in the cold. Because of someone that could be in and out of their life. Could be younger than they are. Or someone that have kids with this person. Yeah, space open your heart. Because people see you as someone very, very attractive. Okay, a divorce. Some of you guys could be going through a, uh, uh, a divorce right now. It's experiencing a breakup or somebody's in your energy. Tell me more about this divorce for cancer, single, for single cancer. Tell me more about this divorce for my single cancer. Family. Some of you guys could be going through a divorce or somebody in your family could be experiencing some kind of divorce or breakup. This is one could have been up and down with you. Because of a Virgo Capricorn Taurus, this is when it took some kind of risk with someone from their past. Now 
Now this person could be watching you. This one could have been stuck in another situation they could feel like they couldn't get out of. This, but this person was definitely thinking about you. This person been thinking about you ever since they took a break from you. This person could be sad, feeling very burdened, sad they missed this opportunity with you. This is one your family, or you used to be in a family with this person. But this is one could be in and out of your life because of a child. Hmm. Or this person wants you to go on vacation with them with their child. Hmm. All right, Kansas. Somebody getting their divorce here or experiencing some kind of breakup. Okay, date night. Ugh. Why this card is here for my single cancer? Date night. Show me the cards I really need to see and speak. Date night for my single cancer. Tell me more about this date night for single cancer. Date night. Ooh. Some of you guys are going on some kind of date with someone that you had a towel with. This person could have betrayed you, stabbed me your back. This person living the distance and acting distant. This is one that could have ghosted you just to get some kind of justice on you. Hmm. Some of you guys could be going on a date night with someone that caused some kind of tower in your life. This person betrayed you, living the distance and acting distant toward you. This person could have ghosted you. This is someone that wants some type of justice on you. Because you end things with them or they end things with you. Because they saw you as someone independent, increasing their wealth. This is someone that wanted you to apologize to them. So you guys can move forward with each other. This is one could be leaving or closing out a cycle with someone else they had made plans with. This person could be sad. This is one could be drinking. Want to speak some kind of truth about their family or kids or someone they should be married to. Mm. All right, guardian. A lost loved one watches over you. Got a guardian. All right, tell me more about this lost loved one that's watching over my single cancer. Tell me more about this. Mm, this is the one that misses you. This person said they, this is one miss you. Oh, you got someone, loved one watching over you. Some of you guys could be feeling sad right now because you missed some kind of opportunity with a Leo. Twin flame. This person could be your a twin flame. Someone's feeling sad. They miss an opportunity with you. It could be a Leo. This person could be going through trouble times in their life. Because of a mother figure here or a baby mother. This person could be sick right now, depressed, full of guilt. Now this person want to work on things with you. This is one who's trying to use every trick in the book to get you. Get you back. But this is one could have put things on hold because this person could have been stressed out about the, stressed out about their job. This is one keep looking back at something that happened in the past. Yeah, this one could be watching you, stalking you, trying to gather information about you. It could be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, or somebody's in this energy. Yeah, this person wants to take a risk with you. But this one could have been holding back from you. Because of someone younger or because of someone that the, the, holding back because of their child or someone younger or someone they have a child with that caused some kind of tower in you guys' life. Yeah. This person could have been married or have kids with someone else. This person could be married or committed to someone that left them out in the cold. They have a lot of love for this person. Yeah, they got a lot of burdens on their back. That's why the person could have turned their back on you because of this queen of coins. But this person is your soulmate. This person wants to move to come of waters with you. This person wants to marry you or live together with you. Yep, this person wants this victory with you. Yeah, some of you guys are about to have a reunion with someone who wants to travel, come see you, or take you on vacation. This person wants an opportunity with you. Could be an Aries, baby daddy. 
or someone they have their own business. Yeah, this person wants their luck to change with you. Yeah, you're about to receive an unexpected message from someone want to be in a family with you or a message for someone's family that this person about to take some kind of action. This is something that's going to make you very emotional, but you're going to feel like this person's lying to you. You might get mad and angry with this person, but this is something that's actually going to make you happy. This person want a happy family, happy life with you. But this person money could have been open, up and down because of someone they saw with their wish fulfillment. Could have been with a new person. Yeah, that person ended up betraying them, left them, and ghost them, and end things with them. Dang. For well, Virgo. Hmm. Yeah, you got you got your, your lost one. Loved one is watching over you. Hmm. All right, single cancer. If you're new to my channel, hey, hit that like button, hit that notification. You'll know when I'm on. Until next time, guys. Bye-bye.